Understanding grams and kilograms is incredibly important in maths, but also in real life. Firstly, let's get to grips with the two words mass and weight. Weight is a force. Everything on Earth is pulled down towards the ground by gravity. Mass is the amount of matter in an object. Mass is weighed in grams and kilograms, or pounds and ounces. In the UK, we mostly use grams, kilograms and tons. Let's start by looking at items that are very light and weigh around one gram. We use the letter G to show this. A gram is about a paperclip, a quarter of a teaspoon of sugar, a cubic centimetre of water. A packet of crisps would be around 35 grams, but an orange is significantly heavier at around 200 grams. Kitchen scales are handy to measure these ranges. The kilogram or kilo is a metric system mass unit and the symbol is kg. One kilogram, kg, is equal to a thousand grams, g. A kilogram would be the mass of a litre bottle of water, a big bag of sugar. Miss Garnet's cat weighs around four kilograms, which is the same as four litre bottles of water. But what about heavier items? The average woman in the UK weighs around 70 kilograms, whereas the average man weighs around 84 kilograms. Compare this to a male lion at around 190 kilograms and a large pig around 350 kilograms. To convert kilograms to grams, multiply the kilogram value by a thousand. For example, to find out how many grams there are in three kilograms, multiply three by a thousand. That makes 3,000 grams in three kilograms. Five kilograms equals 5,000 grams. Eight kilograms equals 8,000 grams. 70 kilograms equals 70,000 grams. If you had 0.5 kg, it is less than a whole kilogram, which would be 500 grams. Some objects are much heavier and weigh over a ton. A ton is a thousand kilograms, which is the weight of a, a walrus, a giraffe or a small car. Let's review weight. There are a thousand grams in one kilogram. There are a thousand kilograms in one ton. Grams and kilograms are used all the time. For example, we measure the mass of food and show this on the packet or box. We measure how heavy our suitcase is before we board a flight. We measure ourselves to make sure we are at a healthy weight. Have a go at the next activities and good luck!